In Vermont, several firefighters with the Fairfax Fire Department walking off the job, and it comes after the select board hired a new fire chief. NBC 5's Kristen Ray is standing by live in Fairfax with more on the decision and the impact it's having. Kristen? Micah Jenslinger most recently served as the training coordinator with the Vermont Fire Academy. He was recently hired as the fire chief here in Fairfax on October 12th. I spoke with a couple of longtime firefighters here who say they're resigning because they think someone else from the department was more qualified for the position. Dave has been doing a great job for the town for the last 10 years and they basically just let him go for no reason. So we're standing up for Dave Raymond and our battalion chief and, and all the good things that he's done um, by resigning. Dave Raymond has been a member of the Fairfax Fire Department and a town employee in Fairfax for the past 10 years. David Yerjo, firefighter for 27 years, is resigning from the department after a vote by the select board hired someone else as a fire chief. It's a decision also being made by several other members of the department, like Tom Snyder, who's put in 21 years. Some of the guys were mad at Dave a few years ago because the town got a grant and put in new sidewalks and they didn't have anything to clear them. So Dave was plowing the sidewalks with a four-wheeler for the fire station. Some of these guys got all upset about that. I mean, that's, that's the kind of crap that we're fighting about here is this stupid little things that mean nothing. In March, several members of the department asked the select board to restructure the organization, leading to a brand new fire chief position. In the fall, Dave Raymond, current battalion chief, and Micah Jenslinger, who had experience working as a USAR specialist, applied for the position. After an interviewing process and a vote by the select board on October 12th, it was decided Jenslinger would be the new chief. Uh, listen, it's sad. You don't want anybody to leave. Um, but I think no matter which way we made a decision, I think some people might have left on the other side as well if we had hired the other person. Resigning firefighters like your Joe have concerns over Jen Zlinger's qualifications. He does not know the strengths and weaknesses of all the firefighters. He doesn't know the water supplies and the, the hydrants and the streets. He's not from the town. Um, and they chose him over Dave Raymond, who's been doing this for 10 years flawlessly, as far as I'm concerned. Although he says it was a very difficult decision, Steve Cormier, chair of the select board, is backing the vote, saying Jenslinger is qualified for the position. He's absolutely qualified, and forget what I think. Um, one, of, one of the people that would help us with this uh, decision moving forward was John Audie, who is the fire chief in Winooski. And John said to me that, that Micah is fully qualified to do this job. We did everything by the book. We, we hired a qualified candidate, and we have people who aren't happy. And, you know, that's, I guess, the world we live in. No matter what decision you make, someone's not going to be happy. And even with the slew of resignations, town officials say they believe operations in the fire department will remain as normal. Jenslinger will officially start his role as fire chief here in Fairfax on November 7th. I reached out to to Jen Zlinger for comment. However, he says he does not have comment at this time. I'm live in Fairfax, Kristen Ray, NBC5 News.